Wieso? Wow. The gates are located in this temple, but they're well hidden. Only we shamans know how to find them. Okay, so that sand person, that was really neat. And yes, the other shaman needs some heavy moisturizer. That was so cool, the sand person. I do believe that was our evil shaman, by the way. Okay, let's zoom in here. The gates are hidden beneath these statues. To gain access to them, I need to place a nephrite weapon in the hand of each warrior statue. Is this supposed to be emerald? Looks pretty cool. I only have one. Okay, this statue's come alive. That's cool. Very nice. Very shiny green. The snake shaped hollow. Hollow hollow. I think a cache is hidden behind this wall. I must find a way to open it. Hmm. There's our collectible we needed. We should still have a morphing object in here somewhere. Found it. Do we have a gear? I think we can go back to the gear puzzle. Uh, I don't know when I'll get to the bonus chapters of any of the games I play. That's part of my challenge is, uh, you know, not enough hours in my life to do everything I want to do. Okay, so it looks like we can go back there, but I want to go back here and deal with that gear puzzle first. Here we are. Uh, what purple thing? Move the gears to assemble the mechanism. Oh. Interesting. Very, very interesting. Looks like we're gonna try to... Huh. Very, very interesting. Doesn't look like that's working. So, put this here, maybe. Who loves gear puzzles? Raise your hands. <laughs> I know there's lots of people that do not love gear puzzles. Yeah. Woo -woo. There was a purple thing in the trees. Was there now? A nephrite dagger. There's another weapon in the complex with the broken gates. Let's not waste any more time. I do need to make a day where all I do is play bonus chapters. Yes, I have done that in the past, but uh, I don't know. You know what? Like for me, uh, the bonus chapters aren't necessarily always a good thing. So, but. Whatever, I hear ya. Ah, the Tohunga came to this planet through the gate of the worlds after the appearance of the first local civilization. They looked very similar to the local people, but they possessed great knowledge. The first thing they did was enslave all the people of the planet, forcing them to do the hard labor of mineral mining. The only people who were able to withstand the invaders were the shamans, the wisest of the locals. But in the great battle of the mages, almost all the shamans were destroyed. Since that time, the Tuhunga have been ruling this world. We've got half our scrolls, folks. I want this robot to activate. Robot, activate. Oh, darn. Please, robot, you're going to activate, are you not? Let's hop into the next puzzle. 
Press the blocks in the right order. If pressed correctly, the blocks remain pressed. There we go. This is gonna be brute force. Do, do that. Do, do that. Figures, do that. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. Oh boy. I probably should be writing this down. Uh, holy cow. Hello, puzzle. Seriously? Bam! We now have whatever this is. Oh, it's a sphere. Look at those symbols. They must mean something. Mm-hmm. Would Elder Scrolls be higher in my priorities than bonus chapters? Uh, you know what would be higher in my priority list is Bioshock 2. But, uh, I, you know, it's just the variety. Like, I play enough Hopa. I don't know if I need the bonus chapter. You know what I mean? It's just my emotional sense, folks. It's not that I don't want to play them. It's just, you know, sometimes variety is, is better for your sanity. Uh, I will try to see whatever this purple thing. I don't know exactly what we're talking about, but we'll see if we can find it here. Uh, you just stab his emerald chest. I love his hat. Check out, actually, all their hats are pretty cool. We need one more. Okay, so right before this spot, apparently there is something that we need to look at. Okay, so let's go back. Something purple in the tree. It's a blue bird. It's jade, not emerald? Okay, fair enough. So is this where I'm supposed to be looking for something purple in the tree? You got coffee, did you, Jolene? All right, cool, cool. I don't think this goes here. I don't know, it looks like a blue jay to me. But I don't think that's uh, what you folks were looking for, but... The blue jay is following us. Okay, so does this go here? No, it does not. Ah, maybe this goes here. No, it does not. I need a key, no kidding. Ah, maybe we can use our machete. There we go, it's a medallion! Yes, the blue jay has been around us uh, for a little bit here. I don't think that goes there, it goes back a spot, I believe. Oh, back one spot. Does Canada have its favorite coffee? Uh, I don't know if we have a favorite one. Tim Hortons is definitely popular. Starbucks is popular. Ooh, it's a hidden object scene. Silhouettes, please. Interactive hidden object scene. Pedestal part. Work your magic, pedestal. We have a poker and a whetstone. Or wheatstone. I always love when people get into arguments about that. It's whetstone. No, it's wheatstone. <laughs> Who cares? It's all good. It's a craven, okay? We're calling it wet. I like wet. Wet is good. Looks like a crescent. Oh. Oh, we just sparked up the situation. That is a very good way to light it up. Light it up, up, up. Wasn't expecting that. Hello, Skelly. There's something else we're supposed to do here? 
Hmm. So I have this crystal. It's too far. I need something long to reach it. What else do we need to do in here? I can scoop some water from here. I generally don't uh, drink Starbucks. I just find it expensive. I mean, you can get basically chocolate milk for cheaper. Craven, of course. Let's see. So what am I supposed to be doing here now, game? Something's stuck between the slabs. Looks like there's a drawing hidden under the moss. I'm not sure what my birthstone is. I was born in October. What's my birthstone? I think somebody has mentioned it in the past, but I couldn't recall. More skellies. Some lovely music here. We now have a seashell by the seashore. Why we need that, I don't know. Okay. What do we have over here? Why do I have the ability to still get into this scene? Hmm. Oh, so birth stone for October is opal. Uh, I'm at the end of, or I mean the beginning of, uh, October. That makes a difference. Okay, so there we go. That bit has been bugging us. We can now put that up here. Uh, I don't know the correct position. No, we do not. Hmm. Oh, we can scrape this off, maybe. There's our correct position. We've got circle, rectangle, compass. Circle, rectangle. We did it! We now have a key. Red Hoodie, welcome to the live stream. There's the blue J right there. Or purple J, whatever. It's a blue J to me. Mm-hmm. Hello, hello. Now, where do we need to put this uh, key here? We still have to figure out how we're going to do this. I don't know if the boomerang will help us. Hmm. Looks purple. Well, it's a blue jay to me. <laughs> it's a blue jay. Let's just call it what we want to call it. You call it purple, I call it blue. And we all get along happily ever after. Okay, so why am I here? Aha! We need this key. That is so cool. That is not cool. Totally made me think of Laura Croft when she rides that thing down. Very nice, very nice. One of the nephrite weapons which I need in order to gain access to the gates is hidden in this cache. I have to solve the puzzle to open it. All right, we have to solve the puzzle. Oh boy. Crocodile. Hmm. So it goes into a darker color when we're correct. Okay. So, I think that we will have to uh, move this bird here. Man, this is going to be tough. This is going to be tough. We got to think about the logistics of this. That red flower, where does that go? Green. 
Maybe these are all blue? Yeah, I think they might be. And these ones are all red. Let's try that. So far so good? This is not there, so that has to be switched out. And we have to get that blue one over. Let's see now. I think we got this first one done. Excellent, excellent. Now, uh, th this one here. Let's think about this for a second. Can 